Good morning and welcome to another short devotional for Black Rock Baptist Church and also Morristown Baptist Church. We're focusing on Romans chapter 12 verse 2 today and I want to talk to you about a new soundtrack. You know, people don't really forget very much. Stored somewhere in our minds, you'll find the, the date of your anniversary, the emotions of your team winning the championship game when you were nine or ten years old, the day when your child lost their first tooth, you'll remember all of that. You may not recall all the events of life, but there are many memories that are there. The good news is your brain stores everything. The bad news is your brain stores everything. Your brain can't distinguish between what's imaginary and what's real, what's truth and what's lies. You have stored all kinds of garbage in your brain. And often it's that garbage that you're basing your decisions upon. When you were a child, maybe adults have said to you things that, that you believed without question because they were adult figures of authority. For example, you were told, well, you're not very coordinated, are you? You'll, you'll never be good at math. You'll always struggle with your weight. Nobody really likes you. You're shy, aren't you? You don't really have much to offer. You've been told you'll, you'll never be as good as your brother. I'm, in, I'm embarrassed by you and the way you act. They were lies then, and they're lies now. But you've believed them. You need to change the tape that's playing in your mind. Instead of playing tapes full of lies, you need to play the truth of God's word. You need to hide the truth of God's word in your heart. Romans chapter 12 verse 2 says, Let God transform you into a new person by changing the way you think. How do you change the way you think? Well, you play a tape that's true. How do you do that? Ask God to heal your memories. Tell God, I need you to heal those memories of rejection in the past. Those memories of resentment and guilt and abuse, they hurt. Heal me, Lord, of that. Fill your mind with God's word. The more truth you put in your mind, the more lies you push, you push out. It's a replacement strategy. Instead of spending all your time watching television and listening to music, fill your mind with God's word. For years, psychologists have said that you, your, your self-esteem comes from what you think the most important person in your life thinks about you. Make Jesus the most important person in your life, and it'll change everything. God's word says that you are lovable, you're capable, you're valuable, you're, you're forgivable, you're usable. Let that tape become the soundtrack of your life, and you'll never be the same. God bless. Have a wonderful day. And until we meet again, let's continue to exchange prayers daily.